Weird things I do for my pigeon. I help sit on her eggs. My pigeon is a female and lays a couple of eggs about once a month. I'm her husband, or husband, and we take turns with the eggs. When it's my turn to sit on the eggs, I don't really fit in the cage well. So I remove the whole box so she doesn't see the uncovered eggs. I just put them up top of her cage there. It keeps them out of the way. It doesn't really bother her, even if she does know they're up there. This is her chance to take a break. She usually goes off and uses the pooping perch first thing. And then she'll go back, stretch, eat, drink, those kinds of things. When she makes this sound, then I know she wants her eggs back. So I just come on over, I grab her eggs, and I give them back. It's pretty easy on my part. So she does a lot more of the sitting. She'll sit on them for another several hours before she wants another break. I pick out the big seeds she won't eat. When it's time to give her fresh seeds, first I dump out the leftovers, which I call Rose's Rejects. She never eats the wheat berries or the large peas. Then I fill it up with the fresh stuff, but before I give it to her, I pluck out the big peas I know she'll never eat to prevent her from flinging them. I feel like it saves me a lot of cleanup. She always waits so patiently for me. So I get rid of whatever is easy for me and then I give her the bowl and she goes ahead and has her meal. And of course, she'll still end up flinging things in the end anyway. I give her a trickle. When Rose takes a bath, she really likes it when I leave the faucet running on a light rain. So it, maybe she feels like she's outside in the rain. It helps her bathe in just one particular area that she might want to focus on. I think she has fun. Her wing gets stuck on her tail and I have to fix it for her. This happens a lot because of her huge fan tail. If I don't fix it, she'll end up going in circles because I think she feels like someone's pushing on her tail. So if I can be around, I'll help her fix it and then she can stop getting dizzy. And then she can go about her life. I take her out on a leash to get sun. This is probably the least weird thing I do because every pigeon needs time in the sun. But I think she really likes to just hang out with me. She doesn't mind being on the leash. And sometimes she'll just sit on my lap. She never tries to fly away. She usually just preens herself and shakes off the pigeon dust. Of course, there could be things that scare her once in a while. Sometimes she'll see a helicopter or an airplane. Sometimes it's our rabbit. Thanks for watching.